Okay, this one's a challenge video for calculating pH, so this is kind of extra. All right, so what we've got is we had 50 milliliters of 0.50 molar HCl. So we have that, I don't know, let's say we've got this in a beaker. And then we've got Um, 150 milliliters of 0.1 molar nitric acid in another beaker or container. And what we're going to do is we're going to take those two and we are going to mix them together into a new container. Okay, so the first thing to think about is what's actually going on in this new one. So let's start with the individual ones first. So in our first one, we've got a strong acid. So that will completely dissociate. And we have, um, we know our volume and we know our molarity so we can calculate our moles of each because it wants to know everything so we've got to calculate everything anyway so let's go ahead and calculate moles so i'm going to take 0 0.050 liters and i am going to um, put liters on the bottom and moles on top um, it's understood that a one is in front of liters so i'm going to take 0 0.050 times one half and I am going to get 0 0.025 moles of HCl, which would also be 0 0.025 moles of H plus and 0 0.025 moles of Cl minus. So really, these are in here. So I'm going to transfer this here. I'm going to use orange. So, nope, I'm going to use green because I want to, nope, I'm going to use purple, sorry, because um, I, I want you to know where it's coming from. So, 0 0.025 moles of H plus and 0 0.025 moles of chloride ion. Okay, and then of this volume, um, 50 milliliters of it came from this first acid. Okay, now what I want to do is I'm going to look at the second one. So 150 milliliters came from this second acid. So these two together, our new solution is 200 milliliters total. Okay, so what I want to do here is I want to calculate um, the moles of each ion that's present and this nitric acid is a strong acid so it completely dissociates one to one molar ratio nice for us so now I've got 0 0.150 liters and I want to go from liters to moles so I'm going to do that by multiplying by molarity so 0 0.150 times 0 0.1 gives us 0 0.015 moles of nitric acid, which will then mean that we have 0 0.015 moles of hydrogen ion and 0 0.015 moles of nitrate ion. So I'm going to add that to our new mixture, our new solution, 0 0.015 moles of H plus, whoops, and 0 0.015 moles of nitrate. Okay, so now what I want to do is I'm going to get rid of all of this original math work because we don't need to look at that right now because I've taken that and I've included it in the solution. So that's going to clean some stuff up for us. Um, Still, I'm going to leave what we started with, and then we took these two and added them together to get 
power 200 milliliters. So that's where that came from. Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to calculate the concentrations concentrations of all of the species in the solution. So let's start with um, chloride ion. So if I want concentration, I do 0 0.025 moles. So I'm taking moles and I'm dividing it by liters. Um, 0.2 liters. So 0 0.025 divided by 2 gives us 0 0.0125. I need to check sig figs. I have 3, I have 2, I have 4, I have 2, so my answer will have 2. So 0 0.013 molar chloride ion. Okay, so we're done with that. Now I want to do nitrate. So 0 0.015 moles of nitrate, which I'm getting here, divided by, you know what? I did the math wrong here. Let me do it again. 0 0.025 divided by 0 0.2. I'm sorry. I divided by 2. So what I wrote here was not right. It should be 0 0.13. I was off by a decimal. Okay. So here I'm doing 0 0.015 divided by 0 0.2, and that gives us 0 0.075 molar nitrate. So I have this calculated, I have this calculated. Now, if you notice, I have some hydrogen ions that came from um, the HCl. And I have some hydrogen ions that came from the nitric acid. And I want to take those two and I want to add them together. So I'm going to do 0.025 plus 0.015. These are moles of each. So when I add them, I'm going to still get moles. And I think that should be 0 0.040 moles. Yep. Now, I want to get concentration, so I'm going to divide that by total volume. Divide that by 0.2, and I'm going to get 0.2, but I need two sig figs, so it's going to be 0.20 molar H+. Okay, so I've got chloride, I've got nitrate, I have hydrogen ion, and then it wants us to calculate pH. So the last thing we're going to do is, I thought I had red up there. Sorry, you don't need to look at all of that. Um, I haven't done pink. Let's do pink. So now what I want to do is calculate pH. That will equal the negative log of our hydrogen ion concentration, which is right here. So negative log of 0.2 gives us a pH of point. Okay, now we've got to think about significant figures. So I have two significant figures in um, my hydrogen ion concentration. So that tells me I need two digits after the decimal. So the pH for this solution is 0.7 molar. And then I need to think about, does that make sense? If I took two acids and I mixed them together, would I get a pH that was close to 1? Yes.